Wait, O'Connor, any place today, dot com, also 937 Hoop Dreams, if you're working for it. It's a dream. If you don't, it's a nightmare. Here with Carter Vince from uh, Trotwood, reigning Division II State Championship. Right, yeah. Carter? Yes, sir. All right. And then also Darren Rubin from uh, Oakwood, two of the uh, top point guards in 937 will be competing uh, the next five Sundays at Sinclair Community College. Tough shot, tough make. What do you think your purpose is uh, in, in life today? Be good son, brother, and friend. Good, good. What do you think your purpose is in life? Uh, handle myself with a good character and uh, do whatever to succeed and be successful. So class of uh, 2021, class of 2020, you've already committed to Division Three, Denison. They would say, why would you commit to Denison and not wait for a quote-unquote higher offer? I just really liked it when I visited. I really liked the campus, and I also really liked the coaches there. They seem like they have a really good vision for me and my future, and they really just want me to be successful. Can we let the cat out of the bag? How, how high of an ACT score you have? Uh, 33. 33. So a guy like uh, Coach Wade, 48 years old, if I took it, I have to take the test twice, combine the score. I probably still could get a 33 ACT, and that's the truth. Good attack. <laughs> Tough Jay. Uh, also played football, right? Yes. Trotwood. So you won state championship in football, state championship in basketball. Right. Not too many guys have uh, done that. What did that feel like last year? Uh, it felt good. Winning the basketball was a real relief. Expectations. Yeah, yeah. Everybody. And playing with uh, Coach uh, Coach Rocky, done a yeah. great job there. Uh, father figure, mentor, coach, great leader. What are some things you, you look at as far as from over the summer to now that you're really looking uh, to improve upon? Uh, my jump outside jump shot, mid range, and uh, being more of a leader for the team. This is my junior year. I'm gonna be a big role. No question. Collective leadership. Think you've done a great job. Uh, work on a lot of form shooting here with Dan, with my son, Colin, um, be able to improve right individually. But as far as the Rocket Man, I, I believe, you know, I've been able to coach Jason Williams, White Chocolate, uh, really babysat him, I didn't really coach him at Marshall. But um, I think you're as quick, if not quicker, didn't say as skilled, I said as quick, if not quicker, meaning if you had the ball at the baseline and Jason Williams had the ball at the baseline, or like a 50-yard dash, or 100-yard dash in dribbling, I will put you up against Jason any day of the week. And that's just my one vote. That's, that's what I, I truly believe. I think a guy on my right right now, Darren Rubin, is a guy with pick and roll situations, a big guard, 6'1", 180. Uh, I think he's a complete steal. I'm a Division three pay-to-play guy at Bridgewater State College. Took me five years to get my four-year degree, so I don't have an ACT score. But my point is, I have a great, great career. Uh, at Denison, I think I have an outstanding uh, season uh, for, for Oakwood, you, both your moms bringing you over here, driving over, right? Sacrificing a lot of time, right? And you know, always said to uh, your mom's one, Mom, how can I help you guys out, right? So you don't have to wait for their birthday, you don't have to wait for Christmas, you don't have to wait for Mother's Day. How can I help you out today? I think that's one thing about our programs, be able to have servant leadership, be able to show action and love uh, with that. And I think you guys uh, definitely uh, embody that. I would say, where do you see yourself? Uh, uh, what's your short term goal? as far as colleges that you want to be recruited by, that you believe you can play at what level? Uh, from the, uh, probably like Ohio Dominican has been interested in me, and Saginaw Valley State. Division two schools yeah, right now. Division two schools right now, yeah. And you're a junior right now. Yeah. So do you believe you can play Division one? Are you pretty content in Division two uh, recruitment, or, or, or are you just a I feel like I can play in Division one. So I feel yeah. like I can play in Division. Yep. Now, what, what, I, what I, uh, being in college basketball for 20 years, I've worked with uh, Billy Donovan for, for two years, head coach Anthony Grant, that's the University of Dayton, Donnie Jones, now the head coach of Stetson, John Pelfrey, who's the head coach at Tennessee Tech, uh, Greg Marshall's the head coach at Wichita State, Dave Dickerson, head coach at USC Upstate in um, South Carolina, is that I, I'm a big believer you need to go where you're, you're, you're wanted and needed, right? And I think that's one thing with Denison. Is a big is is the right fit, and I think that's uh, great to you. It's a credit to you, 
uh, how high academic you are and where you see your long-term goals as far as life after basketball as far as uh, where do you see yourself once you graduate what do you, where do you see yourself in the professional world uh, I'm gonna be going into business and medicine but after like right after college I'd like to try and play in Europe professionally. Good. yeah no doubt about it I think you it's a great uh, long-term goal if you couldn't uh, agree more with you and um, uh, I just want to know how you got six one with your dad your mom and dad are that short did you will yourself to get there just got lucky just got lucky yeah, yeah you will yourself. The generation. my grandparents aren't that short <laughs> yeah true 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 and I think uh, one thing for you as far as with with your recruitment um, as far as staying close to home little but I, I think the style of play is going to be crucial for you you know yeah. you're going to be able to walk it up Right, put you in position to be successful. It's like Tom Brady just, just kind of, you know, uh, quarterbacks out there kind of just hand the ball off to the, you know, you got to be able to rip and run, uh, have fun uh, with that, just like Trout plays. But then obviously you got to be able to execute in the half court. Right. That's one thing I think about both of you guys as point guards. I think Tony Bennett did a great job of talking about this past week in his interview in ACC meetings. He's talking about the more discipline you have, right, attention to detail, the more freedom and trust that he gives you as players. And I think that's so true uh, from a collective leadership standpoint and where you guys are trying to get with your teams far with the championships and then be able to compete on Sundays in our fall league. Uh, we look forward to this matchup right here. Yeah. Able to do it. Great. Wade O'Connor, inplaystoday.com, 937 Hoop Dreams. If you're working for it, it's a dream. If you're wishing for it, it becomes a nightmare. Good our league. Still got a few spots left open on Sunday, 937-499-4345. Number seven, ring number seven. God Thanks. bless. How about them, Dad? <laughs> My son said to me, he said, Daddy, does God make mistakes? I said, I don't think so, Colin. He said, man, you must love Patriots. <laughs> Just kidding.